Hey guys, welcome to another chapter of The Walking Dead, and look at me, I'm driving a train for some reason. Why is Ben there? And it's a flying zombie. Sweet, this is going to be fun. So yeah, I hope you enjoy the other ones, but like how I started Act 2, I sort of started recording this before the first episode of any of these come out, so hopefully by predicting the future you guys are enjoying it. Oh yeah, previously, it's like an episode of The Walking Dead. If it wasn't a few seconds behind. Hello. Oh, there we go. Hello. Get the gates open. We've got wounded. I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. Oh, don't Birds lag. You want to leave the motor in. Well, here isn't doing us any good. You should think about coming with us, you and Clem. Clemmy poo. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. Those look like the people who raided my Calm camp. Down, you're paranoid. Fuck you! Ooh. Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? That's right. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. Oh uh, no! Not dead. <gasps> yeah, I Come remember on. this bit. We know this guy's not gonna make it. Yeah. What the fuck? Sounds like a car. It's a shitload of food and supplies back here. We I sort of feel bad for taking this now. We need it to survive. Don't worry, little girl. Bandits got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. Hmm, creepy lady. Oh no. Okay, so let's get back into the action then. Telltale Game presents. In association with Skybound Entertainment, <laughs> I'd love to be a narrator, I'd be terrible. The Walking Dead. The guy who introduces the episodes, actually, he has an amazing voice. The guy goes, previously on The Walking Dead, but like ten times deeper. Ooh, let's see what's going on. Hey, Kenny. Okay, let's see what we got. Episode 3, Long Road Ahead. <laughs> Look at him with his little children's backpack. Maybe. Uh, maybe. They tend to take us by surprise. Yeah, well, the less I see, the happier I am. Don't jinx us, Kenny! This, oh, this is gonna look easy. No. Not doing that to us, Kenny. So it looks like there was a small attempt made to board up that window. Oh, he was shot in his side, wasn't he? Mind yet? About what? Leaving. When it comes to the getting the hell out of Macon, I bet you're in the let's stay put camp, considering I've been pushing everyone to leave. We could split up. Uh, we should go. We should go. Motels run its course, and it's not safe. Well, if that's what you think, you should probably fucking speak up. Lily's dug in. Hmm, should I have done that? I mean, at the moment, I've been siding with the Lily. That's the good thing about doing these episodes before okay. they've been released, is no one's put spoilers well, in the comment the section for me to read. Together whatever supplies are left. We didn't leave much in there. Hey, we're out of options. Something's better than nothing. Oh shit. You okay? Oh no. Her come loose. I'm not sure how many more trips she's got in her. I'm not sure how many more trips we've got in us. Oh, don't say that. That's Kid. depressing. Let's see how this goes. Gently. Uh, uh that was not gently and that was not quiet. Looks like she's had it. What now? I'll find another way up. Better get a move on. Okay. Hmm. They're blocked by all the fallen concrete. Okay. What have we got here? Oh, I can push the jeep. But he's buried in rubble. Hmm. Nope, that ain't budging. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Locked by all the 
of fallen concrete. Let's see, what have we got down here? Huh? Oh! Let's see what he says about it first. Looks like it still works. Okay, so it looks like I can grab this for some reason. Lily's not doing so good, huh? You slaughtered her dad. You murdered her dad. I did what I had to, and you know it. Can you remember that? Because Ken is an asshole. I have no idea where I'm pulling this. Lee's got. At least Lee knows what he's doing. Oh, oh, I think I'm going to pull the jeep towards it with the thing. Yes. Uh, so I think I oh, winked winch control. So, that's a bit silly that anyone can just do that. Like, if they just left that unattended, some kids can play with it. I think she understands. I have no idea. I haven't spoken to her since. Not like we had much choice. Right. Quiet. Mm. Okay, so let's climb up. Duck was asking about that guy at Herschel's farm last night. Really? I wasn't sure it phased him. Of course it did. Hmm, what did he say? He wanted to know if Herschel's son somehow made it. Pretty sure he knows he didn't. Don't worry. He made <gasps> oh, the thing that the... his eyes. It's not like that. I can go back. No, I'll grab his hand. Sure you up for this. Lee, I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. Oh, you dick. Kenny. Kenny, this isn't the time for that. Nice one. Nice <laughs> one. Next time I'm bringing Ben. Help me get out. Huh? Survivor. Help me! <gasps> no, run! Somebody run! Help me. This way! Oh God. Oh God. What, the, what the hell is that? A walker? Walkers don't scream, do they? Jesus, no. I don't think so. Wait, it was a girl, she's gonna get us killed. It's a girl. We have to help her. How? Uh. We gotta do something. Oh no, she's bit. Fuck. Gotta shoot her. Put her out of this misery. No, we're here. What do you mean? I mean, uh. we leave her alive and she draws them all too. Buying us time. Uh. Yeah, think about it. We're always worrying about the ones we can't see. She stays alive and brings them all out of their holes. Decision time, do I save her? I mean, I can survive better. Uh, 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 do I shoot her? Do I leave her? No, no, we need to survive. Gotta think of Clem. Gotta think of Clem. Gotta think of Clem. No! Okay, don't shoot me to death! Let's go. She'll keep busy. At least help me up this time, Kenny, you asshole. Come on, we gotta get these supplies now. Oh man, I don't know how I feel about that choice. Regrets. Even he looks like he's regretting it. We should be good to clear this place out, but we ain't got all day. Get everything you can out of these racks. Don't forget underneath the counter this time. I'll clear down here and this then we time? gotta go. Oh. Okay. Grab, grab everything. Don't know what these are. But I'm grabbing them. I see, so there would have been less time if I didn't do this. Okay. There's more stuff here. Come on, grab everything. Medical supply. I clicked 10 items, is that it? She's gone. There's not much time now. How do they know where we are? Huh? 
Oh yes, energy bars. Ooh. Ooh. Come on. More stuff, more stuff. Come on. Come on. No. More stuff, more stuff. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Grab everything. Fastly. More stuff. More stuff. Don't leave any okay. I think I grabbed. Your backpack has lots of supplies. Incoming. Come on, Lee. Doesn't look like he grabbed anything, silly bugger. Oh, 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 uh, yeah, come on, come on, no, I didn't make it, do some candy, you asshole, do, you, you better do something, you better do something, what's the hesitation, huh, can you help me, you're an asshole, oh, okay, I smushed him, Oh, oh. Oh, I punch him? Oh, okay. I was getting ready to press Q. Hit him in the face. Hit him in the face. Uh. Is he dead? Is he dead? No, there's more zombies. Okay. Yo, you dick. I'm not gonna lie, I actually saw this bit around Mr. Creepbuster's house and he helped him last time, so... Looks like my choice of not siding with him actually affected things. So that's really interesting.